Good evening. Today I'll talk about Kusum test in R Studio. Kusum test is applied in order to check or test the stability of parameters. I'll discuss Kusum test in R Studio with the help of three various steps. Step first talks about installing and loading the struct change package in library. Step second talks about storing the value in model 1 or any figure with the help of EFP command and after storing the value, step third talks about plotting of that particular model. So let's start. I have already installed a struct change package in my R setup. So simply I load it in library with the help of library command. So library and struct change package. Then press on enter. So first step is done. Let's talk about second step. I'm going to store the value of EFP on the basis of dependent and independent variables. So simply I write here model 1 equal to EFP and uh, I have data set of money supply, interest rate and WPI. It means I am going to check the stability of the model including money supply is our dependent variable and interest and WPI are independent variable. So simply I write here money supply tilde interest plus WPI. It means I'm going to store this dependent and independent variable figure in EFP. So here EFP stands for empirical fluctuation process. And after writing this command, simply press on enter. Now model 1 is created with the help of this EFP command. After writing this, we will be talking about step number third. So simply I write here plot model 1 and then enter. Well, let's read this figure of Kusum test. This two red line, it means this red line and this red line give the boundary of stability. It means if this black line is in between this and this red line, we simply say that our model is stable. But in this case, this black line is going beyond this red line. It means the model is not stable. So simply we can say that money supply is not stable on the basis of interest and WPI. That is all about Kusum test 
in our studio thank you very much